Welcome guys in this video tutorial series in Adobe Illustrator. It's me Arjun. In this playlist, I will explain you some useful designing ideas using Adobe Illustrator. Today, I'm going to talk about the useful tool that is the text tool, text type tool that is a type on a path tool particularly and some shape tool um, through which we will design a logo hope it will help you for you well I am in a blank document here doesn't matter whatever the size you open and then after here this is the tool all of our tool advanced tool here if you don't uh, if you don't have this tool then just um, go to the window and uh, in the toolbar menu there is the in this person we have two varieties basic and advanced if you go through the basic you will get the basic toolbar and uh, and if you go through the advanced most of the uh, all of the tools are displayed over here and uh, in this uh, shape tool here varieties of shape tool are here the rectangle rounded ellipse i am going to select ellipse and hold down the uh, shift key and drag over here like this and I have the black background and white let me change the color here into black and this one I don't want to feel the color here so known now after that I'm going to select this type on a path tool it means if you click little bit uh, more like two three seconds then you will get a type on a path tool here select that then when you come here and click anywhere of this circle radius you will get the default text here in this person of illustrator automatically it gives the default text just delete that and start typing your own text here electronic teacher pvpty.ltd and let's increase the font size after that uh, it's not center let me apply the center align here uh, still it's not in the center if you select this tool direct selection tool you will get two options here that's two icon here one that point that is pointing to the left and the another is just opposite to the right and left so if you drag this here if you drag up to the center point and this one as well up to center yeah it's in the center now and if you want to apply more feature you can double click on this tool you will get this type on a path options like align to path that is in the baseline here if you click on the drop down ascender descender it's not applied uh, because the preview checkbox is not highlighted okay then ascender descender center baseline uh, I'm using to I'm going to use descender option here if you want to push this text more than this then I'll show the we have the other features as well from the selected tool oh, let me okay here if you select the window then after type tool you can get from here as well this one and the bottom one if you don't have this option click on the little icon there and you will get this these features here that is so options yes then if you click this one it goes far from the center and the, the another one that 
close to the center so 1.0 okay this one for the top okay then again let me copy this and paste instead of applying the applying the text it means flow the text on the top I want to apply the bottom as well so this one then double click on the path ascender ascender then flip descender flip and let me change this one mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and let me move this to a center here okay let me change the text uh, instead of copying this you can create the circle again and apply uh, type use the type on a path tool and type your own text which one whichever is easy for you you can follow that in the address here like sydney austr fi australia Sydney SW Australia okay I get the two awesome design here and let me create another circle Little circle here. And let me apply the e stroke, e stroke color. You can select from this color or from the window. If you go a little bit down here, you'll get the swatches, and you can select from there as well. Let me apply the blue color background and uh, stroke and the background i don't want to apply no one okay you can increase the stroke size from here as well or from the window we should have the stroke option here this one and uh, if you want a more option so option you'll get a more option we'll discuss more on detail on other options but at the moment I just want to increase or decrease the weight you can use this option the same like this and let me copy this same shape and paste and they increase the size and if you want to align both of them at the center vertically and horizontally uh, go to window and uh, bring the bring the um, where is it uh, we should have the align option here somewhere ah it's here at the top align and uh, this one is horizontally aligned center and this one vertically let me group this one control z and it's at the center now both of them are in the center 
yes uh, let me create the star a little small star at at this corner this corner here and copy paste and then just put it here mm -hmm. you can apply mm, the color fill color as well from these swatches let me apply the blue color here and the same here as well um, you can change the text color as well select change the font style and um, and other things let me change the color only at the moment this one like this and same here And don't forget to group at the end you can change the color whatever you like to the circle and this this all of them according to your requirement and at the end select all of them then from the object to group or control Z or if you are using Mac command Z okay hope this is useful for you if you have any comment or question please drop on the comment box below i will answer as soon as possible don't forget to share with your friend and if you have not already please subscribe my channel hit a like and bell icon before uh, sorry icon below that encourages me to create more video in the coming future thank you